Okay, so last time we saw that the collision capsule was falling over when we walked into things, and that is something that we can easily fix in the, for example, in the update room scale position where we set the, or add in world offset. So we can drag in here and set world rotation. Just make sure that on every tick that we make sure that it stands up like this. So let's take a look at some of the other things that we need to sort out. So you can see now I walk into the wall and I'm now sliding slightly behind, uh, backwards and that is definitely not something I want to do. Also, if I walk onto things like this, I get shot up, up into the, the air. So actually, I can't push things around, which I might want to do. So there's a few things we need to find a solution for. Well, first of all, uh, the mass in kilos, I'm going to override and set that to a really high number. Just pick whatever. And for now, I'm going to set uh, the linear damping to like 10. That should take care of the sliding. And also, what might happen sometimes is that when you bump into things, you will get a little uh, bounce back, which we don't necessarily want. So we can overwrite the physical material by adding our own physical material like this. And set the restitution to zero. But the tooltip says if it's zero, it should not bounce. Now, strictly speaking, I'm not entirely sure this is necessary, but uh, it did it anyway. So um, I hope this works. You can see we don't slide anymore and we can't walk into things and push some things around here. And I can now walk into walls, which is kind of what I wanted to achieve here. One of the obvious downsides of this simple approach here is that if I want to lean over this table, let's say I wanted to grab this one, I couldn't reach it. It's lying over here. Let's maybe doing something like this. That would keep pushing me away which is definitely what I, not what I want. So still there are a few things that we need to sort out and I'm going to take a look at that in the next video. For now, uh, this should provide you with a fairly basic uh, setup or similar setup to what I did in, uh, initially. What you might also want to tweak is the ca capsule radius here. Set it down to 15 or something. If you put it too low, it the precision of the collision detection might fail. And if you try to move really fast, and you might be able to kind of blink through things. So for specifically for landscapes, I've seen this happen a few times. But uh, setting this to 15 definitely uh, makes things behave a little bit better. But this is the core basic setup for my collision capsule uh, setup, which allows me to move in room scale and still collide in a world space. So I will be continuing in the next video and see how we can improve on the setup.
Thank you for watching and bye.